Then I went up to the Mount of Olives, which happened a few years ago. And on the Mount of Olives, which I believe is the uh, actual crucifixion uh, place of Jesus, I believe he ascended there. I believe his, the Bible says his feet will land there. I believe that the actual place that he was buried was actually on the Mount of Olives. Now we have in Israel the Garden of Tomb. The Holy Spirit is there. Wonderful, strong presence of the Holy Spirit. I always go there. But I think it's a symbolic place where Jesus rose. I believe that he really rose on the Mount of Olives. And I believe that he's buried there because there's a church there called the Pentecostal Church. Now, the Pentecostal Church is the only place that was built by Catholics that was never finished. It, it ne God never let it, that place be finished. And under that church, there is a tomb that's empty. I believe that is the tomb of Yeshua Jesus because across the street from that, from that tomb, there is an empty lot which matches the Bible because the Bible says that he was carried very close to the tomb. The location graphically man, uh, matches. Now that place over there, if you know anything about the Mount of Olives, many tourists go to the Mount of Olives. There's no restaurants on the Mount of Olives, not really good ones. There's no malls. Why is that? They tried, there was a Canadian businessman, a believer, who tried to build a giant mall on that lot. And every time he tried to build, a lot. He ran into a brick wall with the city hall. He can't build it. It's not a financial issue. He has billions of dollars. He just can't do it. I believe because God is not allowing it because that place is holy. He won't let that place be desecrated by a Catholic site or something by selling it for money. So I believe that's the place. But to answer your question about spiritual, I was in that in that tomb on the bottom under the Pentecostal Church on the Mount of Olives, and I saw a light, a light coming, and it was like. I'm not gonna tell you I saw Jesus, but I saw some a white robe in the background, and I knew I knew it was Yeshua. I knew it was a confirmation that that's the place.